Here's a poem for all the people that don't fit within the quote marks or the expectations. <laughs> it's non-standard people. It's called ashamed of myself. When I first learned to be ashamed, I learned to be ashamed of myself. Because that's the way they put it. I'm not ashamed of something I did, because if they did, then I might remember what it was. But as it is, it's myself that bears the shame. I shrivel down in my shame and I shrink down to the ground, feeling down because they put me down. And I like the ants. The ants can just go about their business like we're not in trouble. They're not ashamed. I like the ground. I like the dirt. The grass is nice and soft. The clover is so gentle. And the topsoil smells delectable with life. I like the worms. They can just go down in the little holes and be safe from the looming humans, scolding with their scorn and with shame. I envy the field mice and the ground squirrels and the moles. They got whole other worlds down there, lower than me, lower than low, and they don't seem ashamed. So I got a shovel, I started to dig. I wanted to make an underground playhouse. We were living on a coastal plain then, not far from a creek. You dig a certain ways down, a couple of feet or so. You reach the dirt that isn't brown, it's yellow. We called it China dirt. Like I was digging my way to China and I was starting to get there. I wanted to go. Yeah, I knew it was way too far. But I had to wonder, if you keep digging deeper, will there be other colors? And if you could dig all the way through, There'd be a point somewhere about halfway where down is not down anymore. Where down from where I was becomes up to someplace else. What happens to the shame when you go down past the rabbit holes and below the aquifer? Does it get burned off when you pass through the molten core? Do the vicious circles all become virtuous ones as the water in the drain pipe starts to swirl the other way? If I really could go, down becomes up to the other side of the world. I would crawl up from the different dirt and be under a different sky and be free enough to realize that in space, every which way is up. I'm a quantum entanglement. I'm a relativistic anomaly. I'm the blossom of life on Earth's resplendent diversity. Sure, sometimes I'm a particle and other times more like a wave and a you can't you try to figure my mass, you won't get the clock my speed. I'm a natural variation of evolving proliferation. Remembering shame, wherever which way is down. Oh. Yes. Inhabiting space, wherever which way is up. Yeah. 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 Yeah.